Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am going to show you how to display a user photo or their initials dynamically in Power Apps. Before getting to the implementation, let me introduce myself. I am Harita working as a Power Platform Consultant. And if you are new to my channel, please subscribe for more tutorials on Power Apps. Now, let's see a quick demo. As you can see here, I have a Power Apps Gallery Control displaying the details of upcoming workshops for each workshop the presenters who have the profile picture is displayed next to the title and for the presenters who don't have the profile picture their initials are automatically shown instead now let's see how to achieve this functionality here is the sharepoint list named upcoming power apps workshops which is storing that uh, workshop details and this list is having the fields like workshop name description presenter which is a person or group column and date location registration link etc now connect the sharepoint list to power apps application here i already connected and along with this we also need to add this office 365 users connection to get the presenters profile pictures now we will see how to fetch the any users image from the office 365 users connection so for that one add one image control now on the image property of this image control provide this code office 365 users here it is auto populated click on this one the user photo v2 method is used to fetch the user profiles from the connect office 365 users connector so here we need to provide the user's email first i will show you the to fetch the current users one now here you can see the current users image is displayed right now we will check another users now here you can see i have added another control and within this um, user photo v2 method i have provided an user email address so we just need to provide their email address within this method here for the current user i have used this code and if you want any particular users we can simply use this formula so here our requirement is we need to fetch the presenters profile pictures right and in case if the presenters don't have any profile pictures that time we need to display their initials so to achieve this one i have provided this code in the items property of this gallery control and here this upcoming power apps workshop is the sharepoint list name and you no need to worry about the code in the description box below i have provided a link so you can get all these formulas over there here i am using add columns function to create additional columns to this data source so the additional columns are presenter image and initials let's look at the presenter image column here this column checks whether a user has a profile picture using this condition presenter is the sharepoint list column name which is storing the presenter's details dot email will fetch the email and is not blank of presenter dot email ensures that presenters has a valid email address and this office 365 users dot user photo metadata dot has photo checks if there is a photo associated with this presenter's email address if both these conditions are true the profile picture is fetching using this user photo v2 method i already explained before uh, using this method how we can fetch the profile pictures of the user so here i am dynamically providing the email address by fetching from the sharepoint list column name if either of this condition fails it simply return an empty string now let's move to the initials column this column handles the cases where a profile picture is not available and it also checks again whether the profile picture existing or not using the condition that we have used in this column so and this code is used to check whether the user have profile picture or not if no profile picture exists we generate the initials based on the presenter's display name. So, this left of presenter dot display name comma one extract the first letter from their first name. And here you can see uh, to fetch the first character from the last name, I am using the find function in this if condition. So, using the find function, we are uh, 
finding the space between the from the display name for example here you can see for the current user name is um, patty fernandes and uh, between the two names space is there right so using this uh, find function we are finding the index of the space if that index is greater than zero using the mid function and again from the find function we are fetching the first character from the last name after this one we are concatenating now to display the presenter's profile pictures provide this code this item dot presenter dot picture on the image property of this image control present in the gallery control and when the prof user don't have profile picture it is showing the sample image so for the users who don't have profile pictures we need to hide this uh, image control so for that one click on this visible property instead of true add this code so if this item dot presenter image if that column we created that custom column right if it is not blank then only it needs to be display otherwise it's need to be hide so for this user there is no profile pictures so that's why image control is not uh, displayed over here now we need to display the initials right now add one button control in the button controls text property provide provide this formula so this item dot initials which is a custom column will fetch the initials from the display name from the first and last name it is fetching the initials and it is displaying over here here you can see the button control is displaying for each profile picture right so we need to hide this button control for the presenters who have profile pictures so click on the image property sorry click on this visible property of the button control instead of this true value provide this code now we will see this button control only visible for the presenter who don't have profile pictures this way we can simply display the user profiles and if they don't have any profile pictures we can uh, display their initials from their full name i hope you understand how to display user profile pictures from the office 365 users connection and also display the initials dynamically from their uh, display name thank you for watching this video and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this